Hi everybody, welcome to Neil Reviews It. Kung, Kung Fu Classics. Neil Reviews It, what is it? It's the thing that Neil Reviews. Neil Reviews It, that is, if he doesn't screw it up. Hey kids. Welcome back to Neil Reviews at Kung Fu Classics. Please like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and just hit that like button. That's the most important thing for some reason. I, I wish I understood why that's the thing, but, but that's the thing. That's the most important thing. It's the most important thing to YouTube, so it's the most important thing to me. Please hit that like button. Today on Neo Reviews It, we are going to discuss the Thai Kung Fu flick BKO Bangkok Knockout. This movie, there's a couple of people I recognize. Um, one, one guy from Raging Phoenix has a small thing in this. Uh, and uh, the stuntman plays... Uh, Lam or Lerm. The girl plays Joy. She's a knockout. Every photo of her on the internet is in a bikini. So I'm going to assume she's a bikini model. Shitty American guy. Over the top shitty. Has a game that he set up where people don't know they're being played. And so one side kidnaps a person and then the other team is forced to go find the girl. It seemed like what was happening. It didn't need that. <laughs> I gotta be honest. Like, uh, they... <sighs> I'm gonna say the story was terrible. On a lot of levels. I think the fights had promise. Some of the fights were a ton of fun. There were too few fights. And having the weird backstory about why they're fighting made the fights weirder. There was one dude who's monkey style. Super cool. He was real fun to watch. The one stuntman, he's a great martial artist. He was real fun. There was one point where there was a fight in the truck, a fight under the truck, and a fight in the cab of the truck. And that was a cool thing because they would like cut back and forth. It was That was like a cool, fun thing. And then there was like another fight happening at the same time where two guys on motorcycles... We're fighting two guys, not on motorcycles. So there's a lot of like, kick the guy off the motorcycle, steal his motorcycle, get kicked off a motorcycle. So the, so there were a lot of fun fights, but ultimately I feel like they took too long to get going with the fights. And they didn't, I, I, I'm gonna give it a skull bobble head for fun. It was fun. It, it wasn't great, it was fun. Story, nah, man. Rubber duck. It didn't. It the story that they did give it didn't wasn't great, and I don't need it. And fights, I'm gonna give it a, a skull bobblehead. Also, it was fun and fine. Thank you for watching. Thanks so much for watching. Please hit like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Uh, come see me live if you could. If I'm not coming to the comedy club near you, let that comedy club know to book me. Tell them you know of a comedian. He's very funny. You'd like to see him. He has a following. I'm in that following. You it. What is it? It's the thing that we all